you come out tonight? Can't you come out tonight? Can't you come out tonight? Buffalo gals, can't you come out tonight? And dance by the light of the moon. <laughs> Hot dog, just like the church choir. Beautiful. I should have seen the commotion in that locker room. I had to knock down three people to get the stuff we're wearing. You know, I bet over half your class jumped in that pool. Half the town said it wasn't a good idea to build a gym floor over the swimming pool. I wonder who turned the key. Probably someone jealous because you chose me to dance to. Maybe, you think? Here, let me hold your dress. Hello. Hello. You look at me as if you don't even know me. Well, I don't. You pass me on the street almost every day. Me? Uh-huh. That was a little girl named Mary Hatch. That wasn't you. <laughs> Do I look as silly as you do? Well, I guess I'm not quite the football type, but you, you look wonderful. You know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say the most beautiful girl in town. Well, why don't you say it? I don't know. Uh, maybe I will. How old are you anyway? You can't ask that. Well, I am. Eighteen. Eighteen? Well, it was only last year you were seventeen. Is that too young or too old? I don't know, just straight. Your age fits you. I guess you look a little bit older without your clothes on. <laughs> I mean, without a dress on, you look older. I mean, younger. Oh, a pox upon me for clumsy loud. Sir, my train, please. Your caboose, my lady. You may kiss my hand. Mary. As I was lumbering down the street. All right, then. I'll throw a rock at the old Granville house. Oh, no, George, don't. I just love that old place. That old place? No, you see, you got to make a wish and try to break out some glass. Got to be a pretty good shot nowadays, though, with so many windows already broken out. No, George, that place is just so full of romance. I'd like to live in it someday. That old place, I wouldn't live in it as a ghost. See right there on the second floor? Well, George, what did you wish? Oh, well, not just one wish, Mary. A whole hat full of wishes. I know what I'm going to do today and tomorrow and the next year and the year after that. I'm going to shake the dust of this crummy little town off my feet and I'm going to see the world. I'll go to Italy, or Greece, the Parthenon, the Colosseum. And then I'll go to college and see what they know. And then I'm going to build things. Whole airfields and skyscrapers a hundred stories high and bridges a mile long. You good at the rock, Mary? Yeah, that's pretty good, Mary. <laughs> What'd you wish for? Buffalo gals, can't you come out tonight? Can't you come out tonight? Can't you come out tonight? Buffalo gals, can't you come out tonight? And dance by the light of the moon. What'd you wish for, Mary? Oh, no. Come on, tell me. If I told you, it might not come true. What is it you want, Mary? Want the moon? Just say the word and I'll throw a lasso around it and I'll pull it down for you. That's a pretty good idea. I'll give you the moon, Mary. I'll take it. And then what? And then you'd swallow, you see? And all the moonbeams would shoot out your fingers and the ends of your hair and your toes. And... Oh, I'm not talking too much.